Hi, I'm Wai. I'm going to demonstrate how to connect database. Our pre in the previous video to our to the web application and open the netlins id 7 okay and click file then new project and choose java web java application next <coughs> then name the project wawi wawi1 then next then click dash fish server 3.1 java e5 click next finish wait for 5 seconds then dash fish is generating codes okay then click the plus sign then right click libraries add libraries li library then add the jstl 1.1 library and the mysql jdbc driver okay click add library Okay, click here to check if those library is inserted. Then right click to the while we click the services tab. Then in the MySQL node, this text plus click the plus sign. Then right click the wawi wawi that we created. Why are we data's database we have created in our previous video? Click connect and and last wish generate this code. Then click the project again. Right click new other. Then click the glass fish folder JDBC resource. Click next click the create new jdbc tool then jndi name my jdbc slash test then click next next again and click okay, test and click next and select uh, x16 connection which we have created a while ago the uh, jdbc is a golden mysql wawi wawi ok click next then finish and after that after that we have created a connection between glassfish and database and our web application and try let's try if it is running I click the index.jsp in the web pages and click highlight the each one the lower each one shades then click the menu win window menu click the palette then double click double report db report then enter the jdbc slash test that we created then enter as query Select all from TBL Wawi and click OK. Then 
save it if the index dot jsp is well it means that the j index dot jsp is not saved just save it then try if it run wait for one minute okay I think it's done okay localhost colon 8080 oh my gosh we got error JDBC DBC test gosh what what is the JDBC we created a while ago oh my gosh I forgot click the configuration click the web.xml then click the reference add JDBC slash test sorry I forgot I click the OK. Okay, we create it and save. And let's try again. If we will don't have an error. And refresh. And that's it. We have table the data and hope you enjoy it and and i will show you how to what why it is dynamic open the sql log open then wawi wawi table and this is our data and let's try insert another one data then save then refresh the the website and that's it i hope you you understand and get why it is dynamic and hope you enjoy it don't forget to subscribe and like this video and see you in my next video uh, in how to insert a data you in the database using web application or html forms and hope you watch it and thank you goodbye